Forward skating or forward stride. The game of hockey is a game of speed. If you can't skate forward with speed, you can't play the game. Forward skating, key points. Head up, eyes forward. You don't want to be skating looking at your skates. Your upper body in your stance. You, won't, you don't want to be leaning too much forward and you don't want to be standing up with your upper body. So you want your upper body in a 45 to 60 degree angle. When you're striding, the rhythm from your legs will always come from your arms. You don't want to go across your body. You want to bring your arms from the back to the front in the same angle as your pushing leg. So you're not going straight forward and you're not coming across. You're really going in a 45 degree angle. Push with your left, left arm in front. Push with your right, right arm in front, maintaining your stick on the ice all the time. There's three phases in your stride. There is the gliding, there, there's a gliding phase. When you're gliding on this leg, for example, the left leg with the right leg pushing, you want a good knee bend, a good ankle bend. You want your knee to be a little bit in front of your toe cap. That's gonna be a sign that your positioning is right. If you're standing up and you can see your toe cap while you're skating, because you're not leaning or your, your stance isn't good enough. You want your feet parallel to the line of travel. You don't want to close your foot and you don't want to open it on the net. That's going to slow you down. Pushing phase. This is your head right here. Your skates would be under you. When you're pushing off from a standstill position, you want to push directly behind you. When you're at full speed in your stride, you want to push directly to the side. Your forward momentum will cause your skate to finish off at a 45 degree angle when you're skating. You don't want to initiate your stride here because then your leg's going to finish behind you. You won't be able to fully extend your leg. Your forward momentum will be way too fast for the uh, extension speed of your leg. So stand still. As you accelerate, you want to change the angle of your push so that when you're full speed, you're pushing directly to the side. When you're pushing, you want to fully extend your leg. So it's hip, knee, ankle, you finish with your toes, you want to push with the balls of your feet at the end of your push. Last phase, recovery phase. Once your push is done, you want to bring your skate right back under your body as fast as possible. So you want to be as close to the ice as possible, bring the skate back, parallel, now it's back in a gliding phase, and now you can push off with the left foot.